Hey guys, I'm Keenan 47 aka Wolfkin, and we're back for more Dark Souls 2. Last time we played Dark Souls 2, we just went through the rest of Hyde's Tower of Flame, and now we're in No Man's Wharf. So, alright, these guys over here, basically they do bleed damage to you if you get hit too many times by them. So what I'm going to do instead of rushing them, because there's a bunch in there, I'm just going to use the Holy Water Urns on them. I know you're about to say I'm being cheap again, but really, do you want me to rush in there and get my ass kicked? You know what, better yet, don't answer that question, because I know someone's gonna be like, you know, the asshole and say, Yes, go in there, get your ass kicked. You deserve to get your ass kicked. There we go. Oh, yeah. Wait, did you drop Radiant Life Gems? Oh, Heavy Boots. I know you probably remember what the Heavy Boots is. Basically, um, these guys dropped the Pyromancer set. So if you're looking to get the Pyromancer set of armor, you can get it from them. Alright, watch this, guys. Ah! Yep, they can do that. Come here. Come into the light. Come on. There we go. He's dead. I gotta buy more holy water urns when I can, which means I'm probably gonna have to do some jolly co-op. Whoa! Whoa! Get, no! 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 Oh my god, that guy scared me. I don't remember if there's another fake wall in the area. I don't think there is. Like I said, I know someone in the comments will probably tell me, oh, there's a fake wall right here, right there. I'll probably go online. So ah! Die. I know someone in the comments will tell me, you know, I'm missing a few things and stuff like that. I probably am. I probably am. <clears throat> Alright, there's a few items here that I can get my hands on. For starters, the Great Sword. <clears throat> I might as well show you what the Great Sword looks like. I mean, look at this, guys. This is so largely impractical that I can't even help but laugh at it. Like, this is one thing I do like about From Software is that they they do some of the most impractical things with their weapons. Hi, ah, crap. Whew. That was close. Silver Talisman. Alright, I believe I showed what the Silver Talisman does, but I'll do a refresher. I don't remember if I had any. Alright, what the Silver Talisman does is that it allows you to blend into your environment. So, kind of like the Chameleon spell, this is like a portable Chameleon spell. Watch. And I just turn it into a random item in the area. So now I can just walk around like this if I want to. Anyways, let's talk to this guy. Who are you? I, Gavlan. Gavlan will, Gavlan deal. Gavlan wants soul. <clears throat> Many, many souls. <laughs> Alright guys, get ready for the shocker of what the century. You want. The biggest shock of the century. With Gavlan, you will, you deal. <laughs> Look guys, you can sell! You can sell items to this guy. You can basically sell whatever you're not using to this guy so basically I can get rid of some you know stuff that I'm not using at the moment and I can get rid of some stuff that I don't care about like that hollow infantry helm I don't care about that that hollow infantry boots I don't care about that so honestly that could go or how about the arrows that I've accumulated I could sell whatever I want you can even sell him human effigies if you want to and the best part I can I have a I have a reason to sell all of these because I'm not doing invasions with this character. So I can make a profit out of all of that. And I made one hell of a profit. Hell, I can even sell other items that I'm probably never going to use. Like this Lloyd's Talisman. I'm not online. 
So it's not like I need it. Man, imagine if you could sell keys. That would be funny. That would be really funny, though, if you could sell keys. Alright, so... There's probably nothing else I need to sell. I'm gonna buy something from him now. Okay. The Ring of Giants basically increases your poise. So if you're looking for that, you can buy it from him. You can also buy poison arrows. And you can also buy a bunch of poison healing items. I'm buying five of these because I know I'm gonna need them later on in the game. As for the resins and stuff like that, I really don't care. I'm gonna buy this just because. And let's talk to him again. Gavlan will, Gavlan deal. Gavlan All right, we already know this. With Gavlan. All right, let's leave. Many deal, many thanks. All right, so basically now you know what, where to go if you need to sell. But I know for a fact he moves. Basically, after like after a while, I know he moves. I don't know where he moves, but he moves. Oh, nice! I got him mid force now. <clears throat> All right, so let's keep going. What was in here? I don't know. Maybe it was those enemies before they got flushed out by the light. Hey, more of you guys. Die, die, die. Alright, up here is more of those guys. Hey! Whoa. <coughs> sorry, sorry. <coughs> oh, God. My throat is finally starting to uh, reach its limit with me. I think my throat has finally had enough of me forcing it to uh, talk for so long. Because, oh, my voice is killing me. Life gem and a homeward bone. I believe, uh, what else is here? All oh, right, I was supposed to ring that. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. I was supposed to ring something up there and I didn't do it. Fire arrows. Shit, I'm bleeding. Now I don't I know for a fact bleed basically um makes you lose some of your stamina and I don't know what else it does. I really don't know. Because I haven't seen much um, when it comes to bleed damage and stuff like that. Now, I don't know if there's a fake wall here. I could be, you know, wrong again. Like I said, I really wouldn't be able to tell you about the fake walls and stuff like that. Because I don't even know where they are, really. And this is why I need to buy the strategy guide for this game. Because I'm just, like, you know, lost. Banging at walls and stuff like that. Not knowing if there's a fake wall there or not. Uh, new bad it's I'm a new bad it's finest, ain't I guys? Up oh, more enemies. Die. All right, so let me go grab that item in the water real quick, which is a human effigy and some life gems, which is good. Since I have close to 99 uh, life gems, those are going to come in handy for later. Yeah, I forgot to ring the uh, the bell for the boat, so I got to go back upstairs to ring the bell. But I'm going to head in through here real quick, and um, there's nothing here. Yeah, there's nothing here. Fuck. Yeah. You know, I need to go online and just come back here on my own time to check for items and stuff like that. That's what I'll probably do. <clears throat> Alright, through the door. I think this is a fake. Yep, that was a fake wall. And of course, there's a bunch of items here. What do we got here? We got a large Titanite shard. Please let that not be a trap. It's not. And a firebomb. We got a couple of firebombs now, too. Alright, so not a bad find. We're finding some good items. Oh. Hey, buddy. Die. Alright, so let's head up here. There's the summoning sign for uh, Lucatiel. 
But um, what I'm gonna do is, is I'm gonna run. I'm gonna hurry up and run back upstairs, so I can uh, go ahead and hit that switch because I forgot to, as you know. <clears throat> what I'm gonna do is, is that before I summon Lucatiel to help me out with this boss fight, I'm going to uh, kill all the enemies on the boat, and then I'm gonna summon her to help me with the boss fight because I'm sorry to say, but Lucatiel, um, I don't want Lucatiel to get killed or injured. During our uh, excursion onto the boat. But then again, I have my faith spells. So I could probably, you know, I could probably, um, heal her if things get bad for her. Because I'm pretty sure there's no real way for me to, uh, use my faith spell, you know, use my faith spells during the boss fight. Especially considering that there's a build up for it. So maybe I should just, you know, summon Lucatiel now. You know what? Fuck it. I'll summon her now. If it comes back to bite me in the ass later, whatever. Alright, come on, Lucatiel. Let's head over to uh, the boat. We got a boat to catch. I believe I have to go down from here now. Now, him, I'm going to head over to later. I want to get to the boat. There's a guy over there that I can talk to, but I'm going to head over there in a minute. I want to get to the boat as quick as possible. Hey, buddy. Look at you. Where are you? Holy shit! Holy shit! Where are you, Fluck? No! Yo, she's lost. She's gone. She's gone. Oh my god, no. Lucatiel has abandoned me. Lucatiel said, fuck it, you can handle those enemies by yourself. Oh my god, she left me. Ah! Help! Where the fuck is Lucatiel? God damn it! When Franz said that the AI of these phantoms are bad, he wasn't kidding because Lucatiel is freaking MIA. Freaking Lucatiel, where the fuck are you? Dying here! Oh my god, I'm dying here, Lucatiel! Oh my god, what a bitch! Oh my god. I killed them all. Vag and nice, I got the armor set now. Let me see what the armor ha uh, looks like. That's actually not a bad armor. I kind of like it. I'm keeping it. I don't care. I don't care. I'm keeping it. And I got the sword. Nice. Let's see what the sword. Let's see what the sword looks like. Uh, that actually is not cool. That's actually kind of cool. Looks really cool. Like I think I'm gonna end up keeping this as well. I know this is more or less a strength weapon more than... Well, this is actually a quality weapon, like my uh, Hide Knight Sword. So I think I'm going to end up keeping it. God damn it, Lucatiel. I hope I rely on your assistance and you leave me. God damn it, girl. I thought I could trust you. I thought you had my back. Well, now I got to go find her. So what I'll do is I'll start the next video on the boat. So basically, I'll start the next video on the boat once I find her. And we can talk to this guy real quick as well. Oh, there she is. Hmm. I see light, but it remains dim. I am Carillion, and I've no interest in the magic impaired. 
Basically, he's the, uh, he teaches basic magic spells. But, because my character has no kind of magical ability, he's not gonna teach me anything whatsoever. So basically, yeah, we're pretty much not gonna learn anything from him. Where the fuck are you, Lucatiel? I rely on you to help me out in a boat and you freaking abandoned my ass. There you are. Where the fuck were you? You freaking abandoned me. You left me to get attacked by those guys. I ended up nearly dying thanks to you. you. Better redeem yourself during the boss fight. That's all I know. That's all I know. Look at you better damn well redeem herself during the boss fight because otherwise I'm going to be pissed. <clears throat> Anyways, guys, I think I'm going to end the video here because down there is the boss fight. So, until next time, guys, I'm Keen on 47 aka Wolf Keen. Hope you enjoyed, and until next time, guys, bye, everybody.